Introduction Istanbul is one of the world's great cities with a history that spans thousands of years. It was first settled around 600 BC and has been home to empires and civilizations ever since. Today, it's still an important economic center and home to some of the world's most impressive monuments and cultural institutions. The history of Istanbul Istanbul, or Constantinople as it was known during Roman times, is one of the most important cities in Turkey. It has been a center for trade and culture since its foundation by Constantina in 324 AD. However, over time its importance has shifted from being a capital city to becoming more of an economic hub. This article will look at what makes Istanbul so significant today and how it has changed over time. The history of Istanbul located on the Bosphorus Strait and spanning both Europe and Asia, Istanbul is one of the world's most fascinating cities. Located on the Bosphorus Strait and spanning both Europe and Asia, Istanbul is one of the world's most fascinating cities. The city has a rich history that dates back thousands of years, including Roman rule and Ottoman Empire domination. Today, it remains an important cultural center for art, music, and religion and is home to more than 14 million people. The city has been inhabited since 600 BC but was known as Byzantium until it was renamed Constantinople by Constantina in 330 AD. The city has been inhabited since 600 BC but was known as Byzantium until it was renamed Constantinople by Constantina in 330 AD. The city served as the capital of the Byzantine Empire from 330 to 1453 and played an important role in the spread of Christianity during this time period. After Constantinople fell to Ottoman Turks in 1453, Sultan Maimed Roman II built a new palace on top of what remained of ancient Byzantium and made it his new capital city. Constantinople remained a center of trade between East and West for hundreds of years until its conquest by Ottoman Sultan Maimed Roman II in 1453. Constantinople remained a center of trade between East and West for hundreds of years until its conquest by Ottoman Sultan Maimed Roman II in 1453. The city was founded as Byzantium in the 7th century BC by Greek settlers from Megara, who named it after their king Byzas. Over the next few centuries, Byzantium grew to become one of the largest cities in the ancient world with an estimated population of about 150,000 people at its height during Roman times the early 4th century c. It was considered the New Rome because it was built on the site where ancient Troy once stood and also served as capital city for both Eastern Roman Empire Byzantine Empire and Western Roman Empire during their respective periods of rule over what is now modern-day Turkey. Asterisk During the Ottoman Empire, the city became a center of art, architecture and culture that rivaled those of Italy and Spain. The city was also a center of learning, with many famous scholars and artists calling it home. During the Ottoman Empire, the city became a center of art, architecture and culture that rivaled those of Italy and Spain. The Ottomans were great patrons of the arts and literature. They built mosques as well as palaces for themselves in Istanbul. The Imperial Council Building Divan I Humeyan, which houses the Istanbul Metropolitan Municipality today, was originally built by Maimed Roman II between 1459 and 1465 for his use when he visited Istanbul from Edirne and Adrianople. In 1923, Istanbul became the center of the Republic of Turkey when Mustafa Kemal Ataturk led a military coup against the Sultanate that had ruled it from 1299 until 1900. In 1923, Istanbul became the center of the Republic of Turkey when Mustafa Kemal Ataturk led a military coup against the Sultanate that had ruled it from 1299 until 1922. Ataturk was born in 1881 and died in 1938. He was a great leader who fought for Turkish independence from Great Britain, Russia and France during World War I 1914-1918. After winning his country's freedom, Ataturk went on to create modern Turkey with its own constitution and parliament system based on Western models of government. Istanbul's history is long, rich and full of accomplishments. Istanbul's history is long, rich and full of accomplishments. For centuries, it was the capital city of the Byzantine Empire 331,453 and Ottoman Empire 1453-1922. 
During its time as an imperial capital, Istanbul was home to many different rulers who brought their own cultures and religions with them. The city has been conquered by Greeks, Romans, Bulgarians, Arabs who gave it its current name, crusaders from Europe and even Russians at one point in time. Conclusion Istanbul's history is long, rich and full of accomplishments. The city has been inhabited since 600 BC and was known as Byzantium until it was renamed Constantinople by Constantina in 330 AD. Constantinople remained a center of trade between East and West for hundreds of years until its conquest by Ottoman Sultan maimed Roman II in 1453. During the Ottoman Empire, the city became a center of art, architecture and culture that rivaled those of Italy and Spain. In 1923, Istanbul became the center of the Republic of Turkey when Mustafa Kemal Ataturk led a military coup against the Sultanate that had ruled it from 1299 until 1922.